All right, we're back on Smells Like 90s Rock. It is now Sheila Hot Toddy, DJ Pork. We're all here. I have everything is fine. We need to calm the F down. That's what it is. That's what it is. It's, all, it's okay. It's Got to mellow, mellow out and just calm down. We need to be aware, but we need to stay mellow. We're, we're, we're very aware of everything. I mean, Lizzo was in town. Of course, Sheila wasn't aware of that. I wasn't See, aware of that either. I'm so sad. See, and, and Pork wasn't aware of that either. I'm sad. It was yeah. bad bitch o'clock, and we didn't even know. <laughs> I know. I, I, I can't believe I missed it. How dare you not know it was bad bitch o'clock? I watched her HBO special. My husband watched it with me. <laughs> I didn't even know she had an HBO special. Yeah. I didn't know that. He, yeah. It was at her concert, and um, it was really good. I liked it. She's a very positive person. There's not a lot of positive celebrities out there. No, there's not. And, like, so I enjoy her positivity. It's about damn time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that right? I had hope. Sheila. I did. I, for a second, when he said that, I was like, wait, have, is something slipped through my cracks? Like, that I didn't know? Uh, nope, it just shot up our crack as mm-hmm. usual. Is something slipping through my cracks? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, it made sense in my like brain when I said it. And then when it came out, I was like, I want you, I want, good. I want you to think on that for about 10 seconds. We'll be right back. Volunteer Radio is WUTK 90.3 FM, Knoxville, Tennessee. UT's College of Rock. Did you think about it? Because I did. That was the mm-hmm. longest seven seconds talking about cracks and stuff going through it. Mm. <laughs> Hey, we saw. I saw some movies since the last time you were here. Have you seen Renfield. movies? Renfield. Mm. Ren, Renfield. No, I've not seen movies yet. And Mario movie, both very good movies. Mm. Mario is actually stunningly very good, and Renfield is a terrible movie that's so bad it's good. I thought that's what that was going to be. So I was. I do want to see that. Yeah, it's so bad. It's it seems good. like it's in on its own joke though. From oh, the, the trailers I've seen, it's it's very much self aware. It's Nick Cage. It's it, Nick, of course it's it's self aware. As Dracula, the cage as Dracula. Don't even like. Yeah, I have, it's very much in on the joke. Because when I first saw the trailer for that, I thought it was like a Saturday Night Live skit. It seemed like it, doesn't it? Honestly, mm-hmm. I did, and like it took me a minute to be like, no, this is like a real movie. I was like, whoa. Mm. I mean, you know, Universal's taking a chance. They took a chance to doing a comedy version of Dracula. It sort of worked. I mean, well, there was that movie in the eighties where the kids end up become friends with Frankenstein. <laughs> and like there's the the German guy who had the the German Jewish guy who had the Auschwitz numbers on his arm. Oh god. Who helped them read the book? This is the same movie? They yeah. became friends with Frankenstein and a guy that had Auschwitz numbers. Yeah, and so he helped them. Are we sure this is not like a snow informer kind of thing? <laughs> and <laughs> like, no, he, he has, the theme song went wooga wooga wooga. <laughs> No, and so he like helps the kids read a book to put like Dracula back into a bottle or something. Uh, wait, I think I may know what you're talking about. I, I think don't... It, I think it's like it's kind of like a generic name. No, sure it does. Like, let's see, Frankenstein. <laughs> Frankenstein friends, kids. Frankenstein <laughs> friends German kids. book <laughs> where he befriends kids. Dracula in a bottle. Dracula in a bottle. <laughs> Uh, just 1980. Up, the Monster Squad? Yes! Oh, is that That's it? Oh, okay. it? The Monster Squad. Yeah. Yeah. Starring a bunch of nobodies. Yeah, I mean, but... It's kind of got... I, I'm familiar with the movie, actually. It's got, like, a cult following, Yeah, I think. Uh, Tom Noonan's the only one I kind of kind of know. Yeah. It's like, yeah. soon creatures of the night shall rule the world. Yes. I remember that. I've seen that little... Yeah, so that's the gif. plot. Yeah. <laughs> if you uh, and they they hang out with Monster Hunter Dr. Abraham Van Helsing. That's that's, yeah. that's the guy with the the numbers. The that's, well, you know, he, Van Helsing is is notoriously the guy that kills Dracula at the end of Dracula. Yeah. You know. And they had like a thirteen year old virgin read. It's weird. It's very odd. I mean, that's the story. So like, yeah. yeah I mean, I think I should really just go into ring synopsis. This you should. But was the, was that? <laughs> there's Dracula in a bottle. There's, yeah, I guess what? There's I just, a German guy. <laughs> I miss my calling. Taft Entertainment. Oh, from TriStar. I was about to say Taft Entertainment Pictures. No, they 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 produce great content. I <laughs> love Taft Entertainment Pictures. But that's TriStar. It's not even Universal. I mean, if you wanted to go down that route, of course they you know they did a parody of Dracula in the '90s called Dracula Dead and Loving It. it had mm-hmm. Leslie Neal. It was a Mel. Yeah, Brooks. I know that one. It was a Mel Brooks film. It was mm-hmm. a, it was terrible, but it was somewhat funny. And Leslie Nielsen was uh, Dracula. I mean, it was fun. You know. Well, so it's a like that's what I was kind of like. There's been like precedent for entertaining horror, like funny. Sure. You know. Well, I mean, comedy horror in general. This is a comedy horror film. It's like what Shaun- we do in the shadows. What we do in thing. the shadows. It, but what what we do in the shadows though is more of a parody. Um, this is like a legit comedy 
horror film, like Shaun of the Dead. Like Shaun of the Dead is a horror movie. It's just also really funny. Mm-hmm. And that's Dracula, or that's Renfield. Is it's 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 a horror movie, but there are some f- moments in the film you're just like, ah, that's good. I like that. That's fun. That's that's the movie. 